it's about time to get some fresh paint on this old thing. On my way. <sighs> Garage time. Uh, Orange County traffic, rush hour. This paint booth is about 80 miles away and I took lots of freeways with the number five in it. But I made it here. This shiny coat of sealer was sprayed at home. Just prior to putting the sealer coat on, I had to touch up some of the texture on the bottom of the hood. So I shot this undercoating in just a few spots and tried to blend it in and then covered that with the epoxy sealer. Just taking care of a couple small little pinholes that I didn't see until the sealer was put on. So, this was a little bit of cratering. Just tiny areas, just need a little bit more sanding. My favorite. It's also really nice to have these racks that were provided by the booth. They fit these German doors just perfectly. Okay, my blanket actually stuck to the uh, primer a little bit or the uh, sealer. So it's out here in the sun to try to dry a little bit. We got to clean this up. Okay, this is the end of day one. Everything has been wet sanded with 600. I'm so glad I did the sealer. This has really shown tons of imperfections like pinholes and scratches. So we spent more time sanding today than we expected, but all the surfaces are really smooth now. So now it's just a matter of masking and then hopefully uh, we'll have base tomorrow. This is just a close up of the hood. All the orange peel has been knocked down. No scratches are left, which is great. Same treatment to the back sides of the doors here. Everything's been wet sanded. Can't wait for tomorrow. Here's a fun pro tip given to me by Mario. Roll the tape up so you can stick it inside the hinge pin holes. Mario is way better at taping than I am. We had to re-mask everything because this would not handle the freeway. It's all taped up, wiped off, and almost ready for paint. Okay, Mario is spraying right now. So this is Mario's booth. So he's actually doing the spraying, which I'm totally fine with. You know, he's a pro. I probably should have cleaned this window before filming, but so much to think about today. Okay, having the booth has been a big help and also having Mario here is really huge. You know, we're renting this booth by the day, so I want it to go well and he's definitely the better painter out of the two of us. So as much as I would like to paint it, I'm much happier and the burden is lifted having him do the work. He's a pro.
this window's really dirty. It's actually very clear in the booth, but this window is super dirty. <laughs> That's awesome. Everything's going okay though? Yeah. Yeah, so let's start covering right. So found it with the second one. We can check it out on the second one. See everything you know. On the second coat, yeah. yeah. So you can have something left, right? Really. This window's not much better. I should have brought my respirator. I don't want to get my camera messed up either, but he's spraying the rockers and the rear arches right now. He's just spraying the back right now. It's looking good. So Mario's using an Awada spray gun. Uh, that's, I think, the same as mine. Mine is just a Chinese knockoff of that same gun. There's some pretty fancy paint guns here, though. And Mario's just refilling his gun for doing the roof. This is coat, <clears throat> coat number one. going really well. Just got the hood to do. Yeah, and then I can start in the Now shooting the clear. Coat clear. Okay, this might be a sad ending for some of you, but this is the car just resting, okay?
The parts are still just a little too wet to handle and transport. So safest thing to do is to park it here in storage a couple weeks. So everything should be safe here. Everything looks really nice. So even though the manufacturer says you can start buffing sort of the day after, my preference is to let it harden up quite a bit before I sand it. Even though it might be more work, I think it's gonna give an overall better result. Plus I just don't uh, have the time or the way to transport this back right away. It turned out really nice. Hope this video turns out okay. I didn't have my usual camera gear and it was definitely focused on the paint even though I had Mario do all the spraying. Um, I can't be happier with the result. This is uh, way better than I expected. So time to get some sleep. Take care. I am gonna bring these little doodads home with me. They look so cool.